Yo guys and welcome back to episode 5 of Detroit Become Human. My name is Edwin. This is the Do Me Gameplays channel and yeah, we just got to an abandoned theme park with Kara, uh, Luther and Alice. Getting straight into the episode, not wasting any time. Let's go! Okay. Hi, I'm Connor, the android delivered by Cyberlife. Meet, okay. What's this? Huh? Debrief for the Hank. Where is Hank? There he is. The mysterious Mr. Kamsky. Uh, it's on the next page. Markets predict war. Okay. Let's go back to the previous one. China earthquake kills 10,000. Jeez, 10,000 people. Wow. Uh, what happened to Man of the Century in 2028? Elijah Kamsky was our Man of the Century. His creations transformed the world. Androids didn't just revolutionize the economy. They changed the way we live, restructured our family life, and altered the balance. Okay. He's probably to blame for this Android stuff. Uh, where's Hank? Nice view, huh? I used to come here. A lot. Before his son passed away. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? Uh. I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Um. Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls, they just wanted to be together. They really seemed in love. Uh. You seem troubled, Lieutenant. I didn't think machines could have such an effect on you. What about you, Connor? Do you look human? sound human but what are you really um. I'm whatever you want me to be lieutenant your partner your buddy to drink with or just a machine designed to accomplish a task you 
could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot Connor? Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? Um, uh... <sighs> no. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. I could kill you. And you would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? Um, I'm not alive. Me, Lieutenant. I'm not alive. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Uh, nothing. Nothing. There would be nothing. Where are you going? To get drunker. I need to think. I don't understand. Was this good? Was this bad? What was I meant to do? I don't know. There he is. Marcus. Tech Revolution. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Access for the seventh floor. Request access at reception. Okay. Okay. Uh, advertising and sales. Business and legal. Faster street. Top speed 30 miles per hour. Float. 47 Channel 16 Studios, Detroit's local news network, 1,000 square foot screen, largest in Detroit. Jeez. Okay. Let's do this. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay. Thanks. Okay. Uh... Smart watch. Parking parking badge. What's this? Emily Wilson, her daughter. Elizabeth Wilson. Okay. 
listening. Water service interruption. Okay, cool. Uh, Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh, school. Yo, that's nuts. Dude just literally called her and he's just standing in front of her. That's crazy. Okay, um. So, does this mean. Okay, why do I get rid of her? I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Uh. A fake ID. Yo, just like that. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. That's crazy. He just simply touches them and then they cooperate. I mean, I'd love to touch Elon Musk. Well, f for his money, like, not touch, man, pause. Find package in men's bathroom. Where's the bathroom? Should be this way. Should be around. Should be around this way. Yo. Ah, should be this way. Okay, found it. What room? Let's enter. Okay, further down this way. Ah, oh, it actually even displays that there's a person inside. And like those situations where, you know, you're out there doing your thing and then somebody comes and knocks on the door and then you go, <coughs> like. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Is that the bathroom? Find utility Android. There was one around here that I passed. I think I could be wrong. Yo, hold up. Ah, there he is. I need your help. Oh, nice. 
still maintenance card. Okay. That's crazy. Just simply touches him and then. Open fire escape. Where is it? That's the server room. Cafeteria. Channel 16. Ah, there it is. Okay, way to okay, follow north. I'm already following her if she just got here herself. Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. Uh attack cards away from door. Uh Get the platform out to care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Okay. Okay. Oh, I just love the music though, like it's so suspenseful.
you, okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. Transverse lift, okay. Ah, what's this? Let's do this. Let's do this. Why didn't they just kick it down? Okay, what's next? Get to the main corridor access. We can't take any human lives. The cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Uh, salt. Follow me. What are you doing? Call Central, fast. Uh. I didn't know that that was gonna sh It said Bruce. I thought that meant. I'm okay. I can keep going. We don't have much time. Okay, left him. I don't know what Bruce meant, so that's why I clicked assault. Join the team, boys. Look at this one trying to be. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! Um, the alarm. Do it. No. I'm a shooter. No. There was no other choice. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. I didn't want to shoot him, but yeah. How am I supposed to stand? In the front. Oh. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Thanks. Thanks for the added pressure, woman. to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed. And we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Uh... End of slavery. End of slavery for all androids. Uh, equal rights. We demand strictly equal rights for humans 
and androids. Um, uh, so We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Justice. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. Um. We demand that one state be reserved for androids so that we can found our own nation. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. Let's get out of here. Yo. Okay. Jeez. I can't move my legs. Oh no. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Dina Simon, um He won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory, they'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him, he's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Why is it my call? Like, uh, kill him. I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. There's always okay. I won't shoot him. I won't kill one of our own. Scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. Found the bodies of two victims, a guard and one of our channel operators, both apparently shot dead by the terrorists in what apparently seems to be a terrorist attack. These events took place just a few feet from the studio while the program was going out live everybody here is still in shock if this message is verified and the authors really are androids that would have serious repercussions for national security claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the android this message, message is clearly a declaration of war but the most surprising thing of all is the demand that one of the united states be ceded to the androids in is this, this contentious an isolated conflict. accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us after what happened today can we still Still trust our machines. Okay, it looks like I shouldn't have actually shot them, but um such is life. I mean that's the thing with this game is it is it gives you a choice and you can pick the choice, but there'll be serious repercussions. <sighs> it's getting heated, it's getting heated. Android heaven. Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise.
Yeah, a little cruise at my expense. I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? Uh... I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but they managed to escape. That's too bad. You seem so close to stopping them. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Uh... I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress. But I'm determined to accomplish my mission. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. Why didn't you shoot? Uh, there was no use if I... Shot them, we then. The deviants intact for analysis. Exactly. Shooting them wouldn't have taught us anything. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. Um, no, man. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. Something's happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. <coughs> Sorry, Lieutenant. <laughs> Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. We have to make sure we check it out. Okay. Great. Listen to the briefing. Who's briefing? Okay. He's they crazy. attacked two guards in the hallway. They knocked one out and shot the other in cold blood. Station employee. Fresh blood. PL 600. Got to get back as he was trying to get away. Okay, what's next? One bullet straight through the heart from 50 feet. Okay. Well, that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. Shunted. Fetal gunshot to the head. Uh, okay. Uh, no clues. Okay, what else is out here? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out they landed, but the weather's not helping. Kevin Thompson. If you want... 
See, he wouldn't have died, but he was trying to escape. Let's take a look at the video broadcast by the Deviants. It's on that screen over there. I actually regret shooting them. Well, sh yeah, shooting them. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by the cyber. cyber life. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. The FBI will take over the investigation. You soon be off the case. Yeah, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. You watch your step, buddy. Crime scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant. Okay, what's this? Deviants didn't break in. Okay. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Just shot from here, okay. What else? Something there. And there's something on that side. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. Think that's RA-9? Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Chris analyze. Why is he bald? People reflection, deviants are accomplices. Uh, registered as Marcus Kitt from Elijah Kamsky to Coleman. Wow. A spare part. Let's go from See something. something. I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. Why is he withholding information? Don't tell me that Connor's gonna switch sides. Cause you could have easily told him what else he saw. Okay, uh... 
out of my way, woman. Okay. Kitchen. Look at the reaction to spot the TV and uh, what reaction? What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300, serial number 336-445-581. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. That's the one in I'm the middle. I'm going to find out which it is. That's the one in the middle. He can't give a straight answer. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. That's the one. You're going to be destroyed. I don't know, me. man. Destroy. I don't know. It's Why did this guy look to the left when It's this one! If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Okay. The deviants have just been caught. They gave you up. There's no point in lying. We know everything. Okay, now, now I'm gonna smack you guys. I'm, I'm gonna smack him. Bio component 8451 regulates the heartbeat. Without this module, you'll shut down in exactly 63 seconds. I could put it back, but you just have to tell me the truth. Are you the deviant? Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, hold up. Uh, what am I meant to do? Uh, Jeez. What am I meant to be doing? I... Come on. I got one minute. What the hell? If 
40 seconds. Come on. What's this? Come on, man. No, he's gonna shut down. Ah, oh, come on. Hank! Hank, I need help! Connor! Hang on, son, hang on, hang on. We're gonna save you. Hang on. Here, here. Deviant! There was a... a deviant... Come on, man. Connor. Connor. How about all his men is to get this guy killed? To back out. Okay. Hello? I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. How would you know if your Please, name is I on really Rose? need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Come on. It's better if we talk inside. <laughs> she doesn't want to talk. Do you think we can trust her? Uh, yeah. We don't have a choice. What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Yeah, Adam.
can't stop because of me. You've got to get across the border. You need rest. Get a good night's sleep and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong. Um... Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Maybe they just need time to understand what we really are. Why can't we just talk to each other? They'd see we're not bad. Um... Maybe one day... I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world-famous spaghetti. You'll be back on your feet in no time. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. We need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Get some sleep. Tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. I'll stay with her a while. You better not kidnap the kid, dude. Still don't fully trust you. Okay, let's talk to Rose. Hear what she has to say. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Uh... Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. You and your son live here alone. My husband passed away two years ago. Adam and I, we've just been trying to scrape by. We grow vegetables to sell at the market. <laughs> we'll never be rich, but there's always food on the table. Uh... Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. No, 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 no. We can't keep hiding like this. Got no choice. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please, you've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down.
We escaped together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? Yo, this is sad, man. Let's let them be. Alice? What are you doing? You should be resting. I wasn't sleepy. It's okay. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Kara? Yes. I'm fine. We can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what happened if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh... No! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! Lie! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough! Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. <sighs> but he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. shock following the android attack on Detroit's Stratford Tower. The machines recorded a video message and broadcast what can only be described as demands on the city's public screens. It's still unclear whether these attacks can be explained by malfunctions or if some organization is behind them. So far, CyberLife has refused to comment, but we can expect more information in the following hour. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Talk to Adam, okay. Adam's father. Hmm. I speak to him. Uh... I know you think we're just machines. But since I met Alice, I know I can feel things. I care for her. I fear for her. 
I can't be happy if she's not. This probably doesn't make any sense to you, but... I know she changed me somehow. The police! It's the police! Shut up, shut up. What are we gonna do? The little policeman, oh no. And they know we're here. Okay, um... We have to open the door! Shut up, shut up, shut up. I knew this was gonna happen. Okay. I knew it! Hurry, Luther, take Alice and hide... Um, upstairs. Upstairs. Come on, Alice. Okay, wait, um, get rid of this. Okay. Uh, what else, what else can we hide before? <sighs> Nigga, shut up. Calm down. If they see you panicking, it's over. So calm down, dude. Do you want to get us into trouble? Do you want to get your mother into trouble? Keep calm and just do what I say. Okay, what else? What else? What else? What else? Um, okay. Open now. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Yeah, ask away. Of course. Evening, young man. Good evening. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. Anyone else in the house? Uh. There's. There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Do you have any androids here? Fuck no. No, there are no androids here. Find evidence of deviants. One left. Where? No, no, come on. Give me it. Thanks. Close the door. Okay, don't at all suspicious. No, 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 no. What's your name, son? Adam. M my name is Adam. Is everything all right, Adam? The... Androids, they... He needs a rest. He's been working in the garden all day. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? No. No. I, I, I haven't seen anything. Uh, 
I better go. Thanks for the coffee. Have you, a nice evening. You didn't even drink it. Is somebody else in the house? I... Um, a cat. A dog, I don't it's know. the dog. He sleeps in the laundry room. Sorry for the convenience. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Adam. On to the next one. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. They took Marcus's message as a threat. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Violence is never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you dare. That's enough! And now what are we going to do? There are five cyber life stores across Detroit. All selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. I found the second last one. Thank you. I've been waiting a long time for this. She's just one of those toxic people in life that just get you to do wrong things. I've been waiting for a long time for this. They're gone. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. Okay, follow north. The store's over here. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's 10 minutes until all our teams attack. What are we waiting for? You see the alarm system? Where is it?
Found it. Okay, now what? Neutralize the alarm system. How? Where do we we start? I identify the security system. I think we'll be able to deactivate it. Just follow me. Exactly what we need to run this door. Great. How do I neutralize the alarm? You're free. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Let me free up more of these people. Maybe they'll help us. Convert him. You're free. Convert him. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Surveillance drone. We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. Uh, steal a truck. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. Yo. You'll soon be with us. Okay, hold up. What am I supposed to... Neutralize the alarm system. Steal. Marcus! The skull's gonna get on my nose. You are free. How do I neutralize this alarm? Okay. It would be too high. Okay, how about you? It would be too far. Okay, how about you? It would be too far. Okay. How about here? Perfect. Too high would be too high. Get it done. 
Okay. I hope it didn't have time to call the cops. We'll soon find out. Okay. <sighs> Can I stop wasting time and steal the truck? Nobody should bother us now. What are we waiting for? Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Make sure we didn't forget me. I, I, I haven't at. Come on. How do I neutralize the alarm? Got seven, uh, seven minutes. It's a lot of time, but little. Uh, what's that there? Neutralize the alarm. What's this? What's through here? Hey, yo! Look, there's the truck there, and there's. Network access located, okay. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Somewhere. Nice job, Marcus. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. Okay, let's go get the truck. Okay, cool.
looks like we're ready to make some noise. This toxic chick, she just loves destruction. Listen to her. Some good fun. Okay, now nah, the visuals on this game are something else, eh? the androids you are free wake up go to Jericho you don't have to obey them you're free Talk to them. Where do I stand to talk to them? Okay. My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm, I'm with you, you Marcus. Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! We're with you! I'm with you! I'm with you! I'm with you. Then follow me. Marcus, what are you doing? I'm going to send the humans a message. Transform Capital Park. OK. Okay. Um, I'll help 
help you. Marcus. Violence is the only language humans understand. No. I want them to understand, but I do not want to start a war. They won't listen if they're not afraid. Then they won't have a choice. We don't need masters anymore. We're free. next
Jeez, okay. We freed hundreds of our people. We did it. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. They can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice. Where's their gunshots? What's, what's going on? No, 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 no. North. You all right? What happened? North! They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? Who? What just happened? Sure. They killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. Spare him. I, I can't keep killing people, man. Like an eye for an eye, the world goes blind. We won't punish a crime with another crime. this broadcast with breaking news. This just in, at exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro-android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of Cyber Life stores and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the CyberLife stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? Whew. It's heating up. It's becoming hectic. Uh, guys, yeah, that's what I'm going to leave today's episode. Uh, wow. Nah, this game was brilliantly made, man. Like, with every choice that you need to make, you even though there's, like, a little timer, like, there's that conflict. Do I shoot them? Do I not shoot them? Do I go left? Do I go right? You know, it's... And because it's so choice-based... Whatever choice that you make, you kind of 
you know, you kind of have to decide, will it work for me? Will it not work for me? What happens if I pick the wrong option? And nah, man, this, this game was done brilliantly. And yeah, but like I said, I'm going to leave today's episode here. Uh, thanks for watching this episode. Be sure to watch all the other episodes if you haven't watched them, because it'll make more sense if you watch from episode one until where we are right now. Um, yeah, let me let me start editing this episode, putting it together. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for episode number six. Uh, that's all I have to say. Be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new here. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.